After doing the initial bed leveling and dual nozzle alignment, I'll choose one of the built-in test prints, the Dual Line Test PLA print. This will test both extruders by printing different colors on different layers. The 200 watt heated bed brought it from 50 to 60 Celsius in under two minutes. And off it goes with the first couple layers of the test print. It looks like it's creating a raft for this test print and also an area in the back for a prime pillar or what they call a wipe tower. This seems to work pretty well when you're switching nozzles so that it can clear off any debris before getting to the actual print. Now that it printed the raft and the initial layers from our first filament through our first nozzle, it's going to bring the second nozzle up to temperature, move it over here, and start printing in the second color, which is blue. It heads over to the prime pillar, or wipe tower, first, and primes the blue filament so that when it gets to the actual print up in the front, the circular part, it'll already be primed and out of the nozzle and ready to go. Now it's a little confusing right now. It hasn't actually printed in blue on our part in the front here. It's just printed it in the prime pillar in the back. But anyway, here it is changing nozzles from the white, which it just printed on the circle in the front. And now it pulls in the nozzle from the blue and it'll just do the next layer on that prime pillar back there. It'll just keep building that up to keep it primed until it needs to print blue in the front. Then it'll be ready to go. Although mostly obscured by the camera angle here, it's now printing the blue on our part. And when the head moves off to the side, we'll get to see our first couple layers of blue. And within a half hour, the multicolor test print is complete. Again, the square prime pillar in the back is waste material. I'll remove the magnetic bed, flex it in a few directions to break it loose. Let's see if it comes off. Yep, not bad at all. I'll just review the quality of the first print, keeping in mind that this was the first print off the machine, so some tweaking of the settings is probably in order. Let me go after this raft to see how hard this is to remove. And there it went. It looks like the XY alignment might be off a little bit between the colors, but not too bad for a first print. I can tweak that.